So to start things off, I just want to give a big thank you to EA for sponsoring and providing our first eight theme teams on a side account for our theme team series. For those of you who don't know, last year we did a theme team series where we used all 32 NFL teams and then proceeded to rank them based on how they played. And I'm excited to do it again this year. I hope you all are too. And for today's video, we're going to be using the Las Vegas Raiders, who I think are one of the best theme teams in all of Madden 21. And in my opinion, they have the best QB in Rich Gannon, and they have the best wide receiver in Randy Moss. So if you're looking for a theme team to do, now shout out to Chris Berman here, because I don't think I'll do nearly as well as he does on this, but you might want to give a look to the Raiders. What's good, everybody? And we're back. And today, we're going to be doing the Las Vegas Raiders theme team, which is our second theme team out of all 32 for this theme team series. Now quickly, I wanna recap here the rules of how we're going about the ranking system. So we play one game approximately on next gen and then one game on current gen approximately. So we go through with a full overview of the team. We get a full look because we're playing on both generations and then we rank them based on how they played at the time of recording. So we're gonna be going against teams with similar overalls for the most part. And that way we can kind of keep it a level playing field because as we go, the overalls are going to increase but we're not grading them based on overall. We're grading them based on how they play against the other teams during that recording. So we've only been through one team, it's the Ravens. So they are ranked number one right now, but we'll see as we go along, we'll continue to update the top three. And then at the final end of the series, we will grade all 32 teams. So that's how it works. Now quickly here, before we jump over to the lineup, I did wanna ask if we could do a like on this video, a thousand likes. Now, if we don't get that thousand likes, it really doesn't make a difference because I appreciate you all regardless. It's just a goal for the video. Nothing's gonna change from it. Let's take a look at the lineup. So this Raiders lineup's actually gotten a lot of upgrades over the past couple weeks. Rich Gannon being one of them with Hot Route Master and Gunslinger. I believe Gannon's the only QB in the game that can do that right now. Bo Jackson, another one of those upgrades at running back. We have Josh Jacobs. Randy Moss is a third upgrade that they've made over the past couple weeks. Very excited about using Moss at wide receiver. We have Amari Cooper as our wide receiver number three, but likely won't be playing a ton since we're in the split close, which is only two wide receivers. And then for the current gen games, we're going to be in the trip tight end. But usually we'll use a running back or a tight end out in the, uh, the middle slot receiver position. So we have Cord uh, Cordero Patterson, another great wide receiver, very fast. Darren Waller going to be gonna be okay in the split close just because we have that hot route master so we don't have to worry about having slot apprentice even though waller doesn't get that and then we're in the when we're in the trip side end we have the tight end apprentice as well o-line going across to the raiders very excited about the offense overall very excited about it I'm, this is my first time going to be using hot route master and gunslinger this year so i'm excited about rich gannon randy moss excited about the speed there we have bo jackson who has backfield mismatch and then we have josh jacobs who also has backfield mismatch cordero patterson we just have double me we have a uh, edge protector on both uh, both tackles, so that we're excited about that as well. And I, I have double me on Moss as well. I'm really excited to see if we can activate that and just to use these new uh, these new players on this uh, Raiders team. So Ronnie Lott at free safety. We have Reggie Nelson going across here. Taylor Mays, Jonathan Abraham. And then their DBs is what I'm probably most excited about, especially at the cornerbacks. We have Charles Woodson and we have Rod Woodson, both of which have gotten upgrades over the past couple weeks too. Then we have DRC and Tracy Porter gonna be in the slot. And then we also have Namdi Asamoa as well that we can play out there. So we have five really, really good corners across the board. D-line, definitely solid as well. For our defensive abilities, we have universal coverage on Rod Woodson, universal coverage on Charles Woodson, and universal coverage on DRC. I like the universal coverage, even though there's no abilities on our corners, I feel like if they get that activated with either an interception, enough incompletions, it can be really effective. We have secure tackler on a lot of players, Ted Hendricks, Roddy Lott. We have inside stuff on Warren Sapp and on Trace Armstrong. I like inside stuff a lot on Next Gem. Taylor Mays, we have Secure Tackler. And then Khalil Mack, we have Double or Nothing. And Jonathan Abraham, we have Secure Tackler. So that's our abilities for Next Gen on Current Gen. They will change a little bit, but those are the abilities I'm really liking right now on Next Gen. Going over to Special Teams here, I'm excited about their kicker and punter. They have really good Special Teams too. So just really across the board, very solid team. For the team strategy for the playoffs, we're going to be using the Patriots offense on the Next Gen games. And then for the Current Gen, we're going to be using the Raiders offense. We're going to be using Giants defense on both. That is it for the team. Let's jump into the game. Here we go with game one. You see their team. You see our team. Here we go. We're going to be starting this one on offense here. We're going to see if we can get some big plays early on in this one. We got we got pressured right there. We got pressured. That's on me. We might have Randy going deep. We might have Randy going deep. And Randy Moss 
in the first game for the Raiders. Let's go. Oh, we got stuck there. We got stuck on the first play of defense. Uh oh, uh oh, Bo. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Our first play of defense. And we give up a long touchdown. Nice play. We're going to see here if we can get Randy going deep again. We're looking for it. We're looking for it. No, we're going to take our slant. We might have a big play on the slant, though. Cordero Patterson. Cordero Patterson. And we're going to go. What a start to this game. Four plays, three touchdowns for both of us. What a way to start. You know, I know we gave up a quick touchdown on our first drive, but I'm really excited. I'm really excited about using this Raiders defense and the Raiders offense. I feel like they have a lot of upgrades with a lot of new players that I really want to try out. Now, let's see what they're going to do on this fourth down. This is a big play early on in this game. They're going to the PA. We get back there with Hendricks. Hendricks. Do we have some space? Do we have some space? No, nah, that's okay. That's okay. Let's go, Hendricks. Just going to run the ball here to try to get to a hash mark with Bo. Oh, Bo. Bo. Oh, I thought, I thought we were going to go with Bo right there. I really did. I really thought we were going to go with Bo right there. I would like to try to get a touchdown for Bo running the ball at some point. You know, we're going to try again. We're going to try to run the ball again. They look like there was some space there. There did. So we're going we're gonna to flip our play so that the run's going to Bo. I, I really thought we had the space right there. But we have we might have the blocking numbers going to the right here. So we'll see. We'll see with Bo. Go. Oh, truck. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. We're going to the double wheels here. We're looking for Waller or the wheel. I think we have Waller. Waller, let's go. I wasn't sure. If they were going to be able to look at it, they were really close. Come on. We're coming out in the single back now. We're going to see if we can shoot the gap. No, it's not a run. It's not a run. Oh, that was really close. Looking to shoot the gap here with Hendricks. Oh, we didn't get in position. We didn't get in position. Oh, Bo. Their bow is really... Oh, no. Oh, no. Their bow. Their bow has been mauling. And we're not going to make the tackle. Their bow has been balling. That's two, like, 70-plus yard touchdowns. We're going to be looking to answer back with Bo Jackson ourselves. Let's see if we can get outside. Bo Juke. Bo Juke. Oh, and Bo fought for the first down. That juke looks really good. I know I tried to truck before, but I think, I think the juke move is the move because they juked us twice now on their touchdowns, and we had a, uh, Bo just did a nice juke right there. So that's what we're looking for now. We're looking for that juke. We're also looking for a deep pass here. Now we're just gonna take Randy. We're just gonna, ooh, okay, Rich Gannon. Oh, that's that's something that's noted. That is something that is noted with the under pressure throws. So maybe something we might want to pick up is uh, something to resist under pressure throws. We're either looking for this skinny post right here, or we're looking for this slant. We got Randy. We got Randy. Yes. We are looking for Randy Moss on the outside right here. I think we're gonna have it. Randy. Randy. Randy Moss. Yes. We got to keep looking out for Bo here. If they continue to run the ball well, like they're doing on this play here, we're, I, I'm going to get out of the 146. I'm going to get out of the 146. I feel like they're running the ball really effectively. 170 yards already. I feel like we should go to a nickel because we are getting ran on really well by them right now. So we're watching for Bo Jackson. That's our main thing right here. And then from there, if they pass the ball, they pass the ball. We'll adjust from there. But we are looking to stop Bo Jackson. And Bo Jackson's getting to the outside again. Oh, we missed it with Team Mays. Oh, we missed Bo Jackson is balling. We're looking to stop Bo Jackson again. Oh, nice job, Hendricks. We went back to this shotgun, so we're looking for the inside zone again, and we got home. We got home with the blitz. We're back in this 146, but we still have to watch out for the run. We still have to watch out for the run. Nice play. I'm not going to 146 anymore. Anymore. I think we're just going to have to stick with this nickel. Even if they're in a shotgun, even if they're in a three wide receiver set, I feel like we should just stick with the nickel. They got they got some room. They got some room. Nice job. Oh, no. Oh, no. We got stuck. Oh, Warren Sapp makes play. We have a spy out there for Lamar this time. Ooh, nice read. Nice read. Nice read. Even though they're in this wide set, so I feel like we need to stay with the 245. We need to stay with the 245. I really don't think we're going to go back to 146 this game. I feel like the play is to stay in the nickel, try to stop the run, and then try to stop the pass from there. This is a big third down right here. If we can force an incompletion, we have a chance to get the ball back. We're out of bounds. It's going to be inbounds. It's a fourth down. I'm not sure if they're going to go for it or not. But they're going to be able to take a good amount of clock regardless of what they do, field goal or touchdown. So we'll see what they do. And they're actually going to go for it here. The 245 Hendricks. Oh, I thought I thought I had it. You know what? Great drive to them. We have we have a little bit of time before half, but we'll see what we can do. We're either looking for a deep pass here or to try to get to the sidelines. We'll have Waller. We'll have Waller. Let's go. Can we get out of bounds? Yes, okay. Similar concepts here. We're either looking to try to get to the sidelines or get out of bounds. Oh, I think we have Cordero. I think we have Cordero. We don't. 
don't have Cordero. Oh, it low passed. I just saw on the bottom of the screen that it low passed. I might have, I might have accidentally hit the left trigger. I think that was probably going to be a touchdown if I didn't do that. That is on me. We have 12 seconds here. We do not, we do not want to give up any points before halftime here. That is okay. We are still up one possession, but we do not want to give up a field goal right here. If we give up a field goal here, we'll be in a really, really tough spot going into halftime. Nice job, Warren. Oh, good tackle, good tackle. Last play of the half right here. We're just going to be looking to make sure we contain and don't give anything up. All right, we're going to go to halftime with a seven-point lead. I believe it is their ball. Let's see if we can get a stop. And we're just, honestly, even in the nickel, we're just getting toted on by this Bo Jackson. We're going to have to try to figure out some run defense as this game goes on. We've already given up 234 on the ground. They're doing a great job. They're doing a great job. And we'll try here. We'll try to figure some stuff out. I'm using this backside uh, Hendricks here and see if we can shoot the backside gap that way. Warren Sapp. Warren Sapp. Anytime that we've stopped the run, it's pretty much been Warren Sapp getting in the backfield and making a play. That is with that inside stuff. So great job by Warren Sapp right there to try to make a play. And I'm just going to pull Hendricks in. We're just going to try to get everything in the middle of the field bottled up on this run. Hendricks. Hendricks. Nice tackle, Rod. All right, we have a third down here. I'm still going to stick with this 2-4-5. Because pretty much every time we went to the one four six, we have got toted on a little bit. So we're going to stay here with this 2-4-5. I'm watching the middle of the field again. I'm watching the middle of the field. One tackle. Nice job, Rod. All right, we have a fourth down. We have a chance to get a stop right here. You know, since they went to that empty, I probably should have went to the one four six. Nice. Oh, nice catch. Nice catch right there. Since they were in that empty, I probably should have went to the one four six because they actually can't run the ball against it. They actually can't run the ball against it because they don't have anyone in the backfield. But next time they do that, we'll probably go to it. We'll stick with the two four five for now. They've got Bo back in the backfield and Warren Sapp. Warren Sapp is just making plays. We moved Hendricks in. Hendricks been doing a great job against the run for us. Oh, the juke, the juke from Bo. That juke is really, really good. I think I need to use that juke more. I know I said it early on, but that juke looks like it's really, really good. And that's that's one of the things that's um, giving us trouble right now in the run game. Even if we are there to make a stop, if they're able to get that juke off, it gives us some trouble. So we're going to watch the inside run here. Oh, it's a draw. It's a draw. I, I fell for it. I fell for the draw. Nice tackle. Watching this inside run again. Good tackle, Hendricks. We got a third down right here. I kind of... Yeah, I kind of just want to play the run full out right here and not really worry about the pass. We're shaded down with hard flats and we are blitzing everyone at the run right here. Rod, oh, that was close. Watch out for that stretch to the right here. Watch out for that stretch. It's a PA, it's a PA. We need a tackle here, we need a tackle. Nice job, nice job. We got a third down here. Middle of the field is my responsibility here. It's going to be a run play. Nice tackle. Fourth down, biggest play of the game right here. Biggest play of the game right here. Oh, they got out of there with Lamar. I didn't spy. I didn't spy. That's my fault. I should have spied on that fourth down. With, they've had some success taking off with Lamar this game. I should have had a spy right there. That is on me. I'm actually run committing. We're going to run commit right here to try to stop it. And they're in. Okay. All right. All right. Tie game here. Pending the extra point. We got to try here to get an answer. We're going to run the ball here to try to get to a hash mark. We are on balance, so we can use that juke if we need to. And there it is. All right, now we're going to go to conservative, though. We're going to be passing the ball now. So I'm going to go to conservative. I don't want to I don't want to fumble the ball on this last drive. I want this to be the last drive of the game. I would like for this to be the last drive of the game. We're actually going to go to, uh, we're going to go to double wheels. We're going to go to double wheels right here. But I would like for this to be the last drive of the game if we can. But if we get Waller right here on this streak, we will take it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Woo! That was that was a little bit scary. That was a little bit scary. I thought that zone might get out there to that. We'll definitely take the catch from Bo. Actually, gonna go back to the run here. We're gonna go back to the run. We aren't conservative, so I won't be juking. But we can get this to the two-minute warning with a run here. Oh, Bo! 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 Oh, that was close. Now that we're at the two-minute warning, we're gonna run the ball again here with Bo. Still on conservative. And Bo! And Bo's got some space! We're actually gonna go down. We're actually gonna go down and take some clock here. We can take another 30 seconds, and we still have space at the 19-yard line to get another first down without scoring. So that's why we went down right there. Maybe I should have scored just so we could have that full touchdown lead. So if they score back, we don't um we don't lose the game unless they go for two. But Honestly, right there, it's a tough spot. I felt like I felt like going down and being able to take some clock because it's not like we've stopped them very often this game, right? They they've scored just as much as we have. So we're gonna go to the run. Bo, 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 bo. All right, we have we have a third down right here. We have a third down and three. We're not on a hash mark. You know what? You know what? Here's what we're gonna do. We're, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna call timeout. We're gonna call timeout. We're actually gonna go on aggressive i'm gonna try to make sure i don't take any hit sticks but we're gonna go on aggressive and see if bo can just get the first down 
on the run right here. If we don't get it, we'll probably just end up taking three. And Bo, and Bo, and Bo got it. I'm not sure if I made the right cut there at all, but maybe the aggressive, maybe just Bo was able to get the first down for us right there. So we're just gonna try to take the rest of this clock and try to make this game winning field goal to end this game off. And we actually called our timeout too early, but if we make this field goal here, we'll likely have to guard for one play and we're able to make the field goal. Let's see if we can get a stop. Last play of the game right here. We're just gonna try to not give up anything deep. They're looking. They're looking. They're looking. Let's go. We're able to get the win. Great game to our opponent. And you know what? We're on to game two. Here we go with game two. You see our team. You see their team. And just a reminder, we're going to be on current gen for this one. Here we go. We're going to be starting this one on defense. We're in this 3-3-5. Oh, that's a laser. That is a laser to start the game. Oh, they're going to have space with their QB. They're going to have space with Herbert. They're going to have space with Herbert. Oh, and we got to hit Hendrix. And we, can we go? Can we go, Hendrix? Can we go, baby? Can we go, Hendrix? Hendrix. Oh, we got caught. Let's go. Great start to the game. We're looking poster slant here. Poster slant. We're going to take Bo. Nice job, Bo. Now, we're going to be running the ball here, but the only change we made ability-wise was picking up route technician on Amari Cooper and taking off the, the backfield. backfield. Ooh, nice. Nice job. Uh, the backfield mismatch that was on Josh Jacobs because we didn't need we didn't need two running backs having that anymore, so we went to just having a route to go on a receiver because we're going to be in a different personnel now. We're not going to have two running backs in the backfield anymore. We do have Jacobs out there, but we're not going to have Jacobs in the backfield. So the backfield mismatch, I just feel like didn't uh, didn't make uh, much of a difference. But we might have Bo there. Bo Jackson with a great catch. And there's backfield mismatch activating right there. Now defensively in current gen, I play a lot differently than I do on the next gen. On the next gen, I play a lot more zone. On current gen, I still play a lot more man to man. And then uh, honestly, just the game plays a little bit differently. I'm more focused on the pass than I am against the run because I feel like the run's a little bit more effective on next gen. We did change up our abilities, which I will show you here. And that's just going to be three one step aheads and then an acrobat on our slot corner. That's the only thing that we're running right now. Three one step aheads because I really like that man coverage. And then the acrobat on that slot corner to try to knock out things like on corners, posts, stuff like that. And we're going to have to look to stop the run right here because Henry's actually been doing a great job. It's going to be a pass. Oh, that's that. I think that was acrobat. Was that acrobat? I'm not sure if that was acrobat or not. Now, Rob Woodson. I, Rob Woodson's not the one with acrobat. That was one step ahead, but it wasn't acrobat. Really nice knockout animation right there. I haven't seen that too much this year without acrobat. So really nice play from Rob Woodson. I have to continue to watch for the run here, though, because Henry has been doing a really nice job. Nice. Oh, is that going to be a fourth down? It's not going to be a fourth down. That's cool. We got to try to get a stop here. I'm looking to shoot this gap with Abram right here. We're not going to get there. I didn't get there. I didn't get there. Nice tackle. We're having trouble shooting the gap right now with any of these run plays. Ronnie Lott was able to get there though. Ronnie Lott. I'm lurking in the middle of the field right here. Let's go. We got some pressure. This is right around field goal range here. So we're looking to get a stop. Uh oh, that is a laser. That is a laser. Oh, that's a laser. And we missed. That is a laser. We're going to be looking to answer back here. We're not on a hash. We're just going to run the ball with Bo. See if we can get some space. See if we can get some space. I ran into my O line. I ran into my O line. We're looking for our post going deep with Randy Moss right here. Otherwise, we'll take the slant. Oh, we just have to run. We just have to run with Rich Gannon. We just have to run with Rich Gannon. See, that, the thing about Rich Gannon is Rich Gannon gets Hot Round Master and Gunslinger, but it's also still really fast. So, especially on a theme team, because you get that two extra speed. So, I really like Rich Gannon's speed, and I love the abilities that uh, Rich gets as well. So, definitely want to... I, I, I really think... I really think Rich Gannon is the best QB in the game right now. That's just my honest opinion. Maybe you, if you like more speed, you can go Vic with Gunslinger and uh, Escape Artist, but it's just really whichever one that you prefer. I prefer the Hot Route Master, but if you don't need Hot Route Master, maybe Vic is the quarterback for you. But those are the two QBs right now that I really, really like. Now we're looking to go deep here with Randy Moss. I think this is man coverage. I think this is man coverage. I think we're gonna have Randy. I think we're gonna have Randy. I think we're gonna have Randy Moss and Randy Moss. Let's go, baby. Let's go. We're gonna be looking to do a better job against the run this possession. It's a pass. It's a pass. I think they're gonna have another laser. They're gonna have another laser. We are getting dotted. We are getting dotted right now. And then they're also running uh, the ball really effectively against us. So we're gonna have to try to figure something out. I am gonna watch. I'm gonna watch the um, the outside right here. That that crossing route that's been giving us trouble. I'm watching for it. Not there this time. Oh, the running back. The running back this time. Either way, we're getting dotted. Either way, we're getting dotted. We're going to shoot the gap here with Abram. Abram, nice tackle. I'm watching the middle myself right here. The middle is my responsibility. Let's go. Oh, no. We got stuck on Warren Sapp. We got stuck on Warren Sapp. I'm watching the middle. I'm watching the middle. Can we get a pick on that? Team A's. Team A's. Team A's made the play. Oh, I didn't even realize we were still up. I didn't even realize we were still up. Let's go. And that is actually going to do it. Great game to our opponent. 
we're on to game three. Here we go with game three. You see our team, you see their team. This is gonna be the last game of the video. Here we go. We're gonna be starting this one on defense. We're watching for the run to the right, right here. Can we shoot the gap with Abram? We were able to get through the gap, but we were a little bit too slow to get there. Ooh, AP. I talked, I, we played against AP in the last theme team video. If you haven't seen that, I'll put that in the top right-hand corner. I'm not, not sure which corner it is, one of these two, but I'll put it in there. AP was awesome in the last game that we played. AP was awesome. Very tough to stop. One of my favorite running backs in the game right now. In that video, I actually said I thought AP was the best. Now that Bose came out, I'm not so sure. I haven't been able to test enough to be able to tell, but AP is definitely very, very good. Uh-oh, AP on the outside again. Nice tackle. I'm watching the middle of the field myself right here. That's my responsibility. And we got some pressure. This is a big third down coming up. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Ooh, let's go. And they're actually gonna punt the ball away here. So we're gonna be getting the ball in this first quarter here. We're gonna see what we can do on offense. We, I was happy. Ooh, ooh, I was happy with the way the offense played in the last one. Let's see what we do here. We're looking slander post first play right here. Slander post, we'll take our hitch, we'll take our hitch. Let's go Josh, let's go Josh. Ooh, Josh Jacobs. Josh Jacobs, Josh Jacobs. Josh Jacobs was feeling really fast right there. Josh Jacobs was feeling really fast right there. We'll take it. I'm hoping this is a cover two right here. We're looking for Randy Moss. It's not going to be a cover two. We need to just take Bo. We just need to take Bo. Nice job staying in bounds, Bo. Bo, Bo. Nice job staying in bounds, Bo. Nice job getting the first down for us right there. So it was a cover three. We should plan on being a cover three now. Since they were in a cover three that play, I'm just going to assume here that they're going to be in the cover three again. We're actually looking for Amari Cooper going across the field on this post. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. It was a cover one on the last play, so we're gonna be looking for Randy Moss going deep. I think we have Randy. I think we have Randy. Let's go. Let's go, Randy. Yes. Ooh, it's a draw, it's a draw. No, it's an RPO, it's an RPO. Armstrong makes the play. Oh, we didn't get our adjustments in. We didn't get our adjustments in. Oh, and Malcolm Smith makes the play now. The defense has just made plays to start this drive off. I'm watching the route going deep. We send our spy. Can we get a pick on that, Abram? Abram? We got some space. Come on, Abram, can we get there? Oh, we're not gonna get there, but we'll definitely take that. Let's go. We're looking slander post right here. We're looking slander post. I think we're gonna have Waller, Waller. Middle of the field is my responsibility right here. Ooh, nice job. Nice job making the play in the backfield. I'm, I'm almost never ready. I'm almost never ready for running back screens. They went to it there, nice play. We didn't get our adjustments in. We didn't get our adjustments in. Yes, yes, yes. We're looking for Randy Moss. We're looking for Randy Moss. Yes, Randy. Come on. I'm watching the middle of the field right here. Yes, Malcolm Smith. Again, the middle is my responsibility. Malcolm Smith. Malcolm Smith is awesome right now. And that is actually going to do it. Great game to our opponent. And that's actually going to do it for the video. I hope you all enjoyed the series. And I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please remember to like, comment, subscribe. Only if you want to. Take it easy. Peace. Remember, we'll be going over the updated rankings in each and every episode. I'll see you all in the next one.